Oh, okay, this is Coach Trezik of Coach Trezik's videos. And you probably wondering, you haven't seen a Coach Trezik video in some time, and you're probably wondering, what the fuck's up with this dude? You haven't seen him in a hell of a long time. It's like, you know, you've seen this Amish guy, this Jebediah guy, uh, Jebediah guy, you know, shooting Coach Trezik's guns and stuff, and you're probably wondering, well, what the hell is up with Coach Trezik, actually? It's like, you know, he's been on a hiatus. Well, gotten a little bit preoccupied here this summer, and I can tell you, one of the things we've been doing is, get the signature walker here we we've been uh, standing with walker you've seen that one before but we have and it's actually worked out a little bit to our benefit because we have a few more freedoms in this state than other states have and oh by the way now that everybody's seeing what's in Obamacare who likes what's in it that's why you don't vote for a bill so that you can see what's in it I think we need to send everybody that's in Congress right now, packing. Democrat, Republican, doesn't matter, packing. All of them. Uh, 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 that's, what, that's what needs to be done. Uh, uh, but anyway, Coach Zeke's not gonna get political here, not gonna get into this kind of stuff. You're probably wondering what the fuck Coach Zeke's been doing. Well, other than the meteorologist Zeke videos, that's about the only Coach Zeke videos anybody's really seen over the past year. I kind of like playing that character with the big fucking coat, you know, and signature yardstick. I'll probably do a few more of those. Uh, you know, in fact, this year in the Coaster Zeke channel, we should really have a first snowfall contest. Find, you know, have people guess when the first time is Coaster Zeke will get out. And I don't like to be checking my cameras all the time, but they love to fail on me. That's what they do. But anyway, what else have we been doing? Well, we tried to do some building projects around here. We were going to get some building projects going around the property here and we had you know it's a good faith effort but nothing ever got done on it so we didn't get diddly fuck done on that but 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 you know we gave it a good shot and we had you know we you know we we we, we, we had good intentions so uh what else been going on around here well i tell you uh it's been a while since i've done an actual coach zeke video and i know the gun snobs a few of them you know I don't know if it's not so much that or just people with a lot of time on their hands, you know, get a little nasty in the comments section. Hey, if you, you if you have a YouTube channel, you're going to have that, you know. And, and I know uh, there, were, there, there were some that were saying, you know, something to the effect of, what's up with this out of shape fucker? You know, it's always pulling his pants up and, you know, fucking around. Get, you know, babbling on before he ever shoots a gun. Well, you know, and that's why I had to start putting parody nests in my videos so that people understood, you know. It's, it's like, you know, uh, and as far as the receding hairline, like with kids, it's not a receding hairline. It's fucking hair having taken a vacation on you, too. Uh, that's what's going to happen. You're in your nest. That's the thing is, as you get older, that's the shit that's going to happen. But you, you can deal with that. And, hey, it ain't, it ain't so bad because, hey, if you look like that, you know, it might just, might just be natural... Uh, my, you know, it might be, just be natural birth control. You know, if you aren't, if you're, if you're not uh, linked up with somebody or broke up with them and paying child support right now, uh, yeah, yeah, pretty good odds you won't be. So, you know, you gotta look on the bright side of things. Oh, what the hell? You know, I don't mind the, the cosmetic shit that you can deal with, but what, the part I'm not looking forward to is, you know, when I get older, really old, and be shuffling my way literally with a walker through the hallways of a nursing home, leaving a trail of piss and shit behind me. That's what I'm not looking forward to. But anyway, what else has Coach Zeke been doing? Actually, Coach Zeke got out and did some fucking running this fall. Could you fucking believe it? For like the last month or so, actually even entered my first race ever, which happened to be a mud run. I didn't really realize what a mud run was until they sent the itinerary. And I thought it was just jogging your ass through some mud. I didn't I didn't know about the crawling part through part of the mud uh, through the mud part of it, but I found out about it. But it went much better than I thought because not only what did I stay with the pack, but I actually actually won my age group. So you know I actually brought back believe it or not, brought back the muddy shoe. Uh, first place in, a, in my age group now. Of course the old, younger you are the more competition there is you have that. But uh, but uh, anyway what I will say about that is if you ever get involved in a mud run, you're a middle-aged person like me, it's like you want, you, you don't want to do any fucking Spartan challenge or or, 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 any, or 
and shit like that, or uh, you know, you aren't gonna be able to do it, do that shit, or or tough mudder, you know. No, they're gonna be hauling your ass off on the golf cart at the very least, probably the ambulance. So that ain't gonna happen. You need to get in one where the kid, where kids run in it too, like whole family friendly type of thing. That way, if the kids can do it, you can probably do it with a little training. And better yet, if you're along the way, find some kids stuck in the mud, in the muck, you can help them out. Uh, 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 it's, uh, you know, that's the proper thing to do. However, I found a couple of hot chicks that were stuck in the mud, and, and I was like, well, f well fuck them. I, I, if I had gone to stop to help them, uh, fuck, uh, fun coast and Zeke would be stuck in the mud too. So, you know, it's like at that point, you gotta do what you gotta do. You, you, you can't fuck around with this yet. But anyway, hopefully our camera's still going. Gotta real quickly show you a few things that I really like. Tika T3. Rifle, we're not gonna do much shooting today. This is a 22 250. Uh, you've seen it in some very early videos. Don't lose this fucking uh, box magazine. It only holds three shots, but costs you a hundred bucks if you do. These son of a bitches are deadly accurate. Really like them, but uh, the thing is, uh, should have got it in a 20, in a 243 or, or larger for, you know, varmint slash deer rifle. If you don't do a lot of varmint hunting, Probably doesn't make a lot of sense to have a 22-250. But anyway, uh, what else? Things we're not going to shoot today, like the safety check as always. Taurus 22 Magnum. Fucking. Rimfire ammo not available anymore. So, you know, so if you own anything 22, I guess you've got, unless you've got a stockpile somewhere, you've got, you know, something of an antique that's not really old on your hands in a lot of cases. Oh, what else? Uh, oh, maybe the actual gun people know what's up with this. Bought this last fall. Uh, Glock version of the kel Sub 2000. Had the Beretta version before that. And it jammed all the time, and guess what? After uh, last fall, it worked good. This summer, jamming a lot. I don't know. Maybe somebody can weigh in on that one. Uh, the only other thing I was going to do is show you one other last thing here. And that is, for our last shooting thing, empty out the empties. And safety check. That's why you're always careful picking up a gun. I knew they were all shot off, but... Anyway, Smith & Wesson, you can pick up these 1970-era Smith & Wessons for not a lot of money at a gun show. They're pretty cool, I think. Anyway, but to, end, to end off the video, I'm just going to do a little shooting with that. About, you know, shoot six rounds off, call you good. Just doing a little reintroduction here of Coaster Zeke, since you haven't seen me in a while. Better yet, you get to see how bad I suck. Well, I, uh, you actually can't see the target, but that's probably just as well. Because in double action, I fucking suck. I'll admit it. Single action, I can do pretty good, but who the fuck's going to want to sit out here watching a video for too long, watching my ass get on target. So we're just going to plink away. Doing it from a sit down position. And it's Okay to dry fire these two if you aren't out yet. But anyway, we'll call that a wrap, a reintroduction of Coaster Zeke, and hopefully we'll see me in some more videos coming up.